good evening. I'm excited to chat with you about what it's like to be a stylist at Stella Dot, and we have a fantastic guest here tonight. So let me get our amazing guest, Alexandria, in as everybody's logging on. Hi. Hey guys, happy Wednesday night. We've got lots to talk about, including summer product. I've got a sampling here to show you because even though I know that's not what this is about, today was the launch of our new summer line. So I gotta show you. I gotta show you a few things. It would be kind of wrong not to, right? Hi, Stacey Ann. Okay, as we're waiting for everybody to log in, hey, Valerie, I want to remind you how this works. I'm gonna get to chat with a stylist. I particularly love the stylist. Her name is Alexandria Stambach. She is incredible, so fun. So funny, so inspiring. You're gonna love hearing from her. So while we're waiting for her to join and everybody's logging in, as we chat, all you have to do um, is invite your friends and all you need to do to be entered in our drawing, which happens on Wednesday nights when we do this, is chat in, or comment in the thread below, hashtag SDJoy and tag two friends. That's all you gotta do. And if you do that, then you are automatically entered in the drawing and we'll be drawing for a $250 shopping spree for some lucky shopper. Hi, Heather. Um, okay, so I'm excited to show you all kinds of things here while we're waiting for Alexandria. I mean, I don't even know where to begin because the collection is so fantastic. Let me just see if she's here before I start showing you a few of these things. All right, Alexandria, when you, um, Alexandra, when you get on, I'm gonna call you Alex, because it's just sort of um, request, okay? All right, so let me just, while we're waiting for her, can I just show you a couple of these things? This guy, oh, there she is. I just saw her, hold on, we'll get her added. This guy, I gotta tell you, I think this Bricks necklace is kind of the, the, the hit of the year so far. Lots of people saying how much they love this. Oh. I just, uh, sorry, Alex, I added you. For some reason, it didn't add you. It says adding. Make sure you have your ear, um, your, ear pot, your earbuds in as well. That's for Alex, not everybody else. Okay, it says she's adding. Adding. Alex, if you can hear me, you have to make sure that your settings are correct. Sometimes when it says adding, adding, adding like this, it's because your settings. Oh, there you are. Hi. I'm so glad you're calling me Alex because they only call me Alexandria when I'm in trouble. I, I, I hope I'm not that. in trouble. <laughs> you are not in trouble. You are anything but in trouble. Okay, we're going to do a, before we get down to business, I thought we'd have some fun with the new product line that launched today. What do you think? May I Heck say, yeah. your hair yeah. is always on point, but it is super on point tonight. Right. So while Thank you for giving me a reason to do my hair today. Yes, you and I are both on <laughs> East Coast time. So we're both looking, I think we should give ourselves a round of applause that we're looking pretty good for 8 o'clock. I think so. Okay. So a couple of things, I, pieces that I love. Do you have a favorite from the new collection that launched today? I, I am obsessed with, I just so happen to have my... I'm in my office, my girl boss office. I so like it. Sneak peeks behind me, but I can't get enough of these. I feel these. like those are very Alex. Yeah. <laughs> what about these ones? While we're talking. Yes. While we're I talking actually. Amazing earrings. I'm all about these guys. And, just... and, and these. This is for my younger daughter because she's all about lemons. She okay, loves I lemons. Love that, and I'm not young. Um, this necklace I love, and you can wear it like two or three different ways. The strands come apart, you can wear them long, you can do all kinds of stuff with that. I also think these, um, these heart necklaces, both in the, oh, you've got the turquoise on as a, as a bracelet. Oh, but mine's got a knot in it somehow. These two, I mean, I love these. The Bricks bracelets, I mean, can't you just see yourself with these all stacked up? Okay, last one I gotta share, this guy. And you can't really see it, but this macrame bead on this and this vacation cardigan and this white tank top. There you go. Throw on some cute jeans. Bring on summer. Yes. Um, that's that's going to be my look on repeat. I love a cardigan. I'm actually wearing the Carly as a cardigan. All right. Now that we have figured all that out, let me officially introduce now that we've got 
about 88 people watching us live and more joining by the second. Let me officially introduce myself and my counterpart here, depending on which side of the screen she's showing. She's that way to me. Um, and actually, our wall color is the same, so it looks like we're weirdly in the same room. It does. Which I You're like. welcome here anytime, Danielle. We would love to have you. Right back at you. All right, well, <laughs> well, Alex is this incredible stylist. Um, what state are you in? These days. I'm in Pennsylvania. I was right. Okay, Pennsylvania. She has been with us for how many years? Five. How is that Luck even possible? Lucky number five. And it's I'm lucky like year. just met you yesterday. So we're going to get to hear from her. My name is Danielle Redner. I have the best job title, I think, in the world. I'm the Chief Inspiration Officer. We say CIO, but it doesn't stand for information. Oh, no. Stands for, thank goodness, or we'd be in big trouble because I'm not so much on the tech <laughs> side. But it is for inspiration around here, which is a big part of our business. And so I'm excited to, uh, to get to share with you just a little bit about what it's like to be a stylist through the eyes of someone who does it every day, and that is this incredible lady. So two daughters, how old again? Um, my oldest is 13, and my youngest is 10. So you're like right at that like girl age. Oh, we are all girl, and you should see the Stella and Dot lit wish list going on. They are ready to be stylists. I, I'm, I'm waiting for the apprentice program to start, so yeah, I can just... I like it. I like it. They probably already are. They probably help They are. Yeah. They absolutely are. Yeah, that's what happened. So two daughters, you know, busy woman. What? Tell us what you did before Stella and Dot, before you joined us five years ago. So... Um, I'm secret smart girl nerd alert about to happen. I um, have a degree in math and I, I the, all the girls, the few, like the one or two token girls that study math looked like men. So it was me and the guys and then like a, a girl that looked like a guy. Okay. Um, I knew you were super smart. <laughs> I mean, you have to be around you very long to figure that out, but I did not know your degree was in math. Math. Yep. And um, my corporate job has been 20 something, I don't want to say my real age, of um, project management in software technology and in the pharmaceutical space. So more, more nerd alert happening, right? Not so exciting. <laughs> I, I don't think it's nerdy at all. I think nerdy is cool. Um, yeah. So. And do you still work in that field, Alex? Well, um, it kind of is a little bit of a spoil alert, but no, I do not. I no longer work um, that job. So five years ago, when you started with Stella and Dot, you were doing that full time. Correct. Had two daughters um, at that time who were like three, five years younger. You're the math. You're the math <laughs> genius. Um, right. And so you were busy doing that. Eight, how did you How did you find out about Stella and Dot? Um. So I. I, a couple of my girlfriends, went, we all went to the same pool, and we ran into um, the greatest uh, the greatest of all time, Beth Pensabine, who was doing a vendor event at our pool, and she booked, um, booked with one of my good friends, and I went and had a $1,000 wish list, and that, that friend is actually on, on the team now, and she should have totally sponsored me, but I ended up bringing her along because I took the plunge sooner, but... I'll share why later when you're ready for me to share that. Okay, so you meet Beth. She's just set up with her jewels at the pool. On That's Sunday, right. I assume. That's right. And there was cocktails. Yeah. And there was cocktails. <laughs> and there were cocktails. Just like cocktails and pool and kids. Doing and fun. On a summer day in, in PA. Right. Okay. And so you meet her. You like the stuff. And, and do you immediately think, I want to sell this? Or how does that happen? No. Actually, um... I had no desire and no intention of selling. And I actually wasn't really interested in hosting at all either. But I was totally fine to go to my friend's event and shop away. That's like, that's all I could handle. You were like, just, I just like the, I like the stuff. I like the stuff. It's pretty. And I can see myself wearing some stuff. I, I like more than one thing. So I'll go and I'll shop. But that's as far as I go. Do you remember? Was there like a special piece that like yes. caught your eye? A hundred percent. Yes. It was the turquoise super long beads that you could wrap around like three times. Oh, I remember and you could put those. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Love those. I think and I, I strangled really... myself on those once, once or twice. I know the one. I wanted that metropolitan necklace too. Oh, and I... oh that the sparkly brochy one. Yes. So I wanted that like, so bad. 
you know, um, I, I'm a bit of a like wine nerd and in wine, wine culture, people always say, what was the bottle that did it for you? Like, what yes. was the bottle you drank? And you were like, I understand wine. Listen, and, you, and I think you're preaching. Bottles, it's like, what was the piece? Yes, you're preaching my language. I'm from San Francisco, and I basically grew up in Napa on the weekends. So you know the bottle, but you also I know the bottle. What was the earring? What was the earring that did it for you? Right, that's the language here. What was exactly? The yeah, exactly. that's great. Love it. The long turquoise one. Okay, amazing. Okay, so you weren't you weren't really in that. You were just like love the stuff. Specifically, want that piece. Not really even into hosting. What happens that you end up becoming a stylist? So um, somehow I got twisted my arm into hosting because I had a thousand dollar wish list and there was no way I was going to be spending a thousand dollars. So I did end up hosting, but um, I still had no desire to be a stylist. And like, I, that was the first thing from my mind, especially with everything I had going on, you know, with my kids and my job and my husband and all the stuff that everybody's got all the stuff. Right. So um but now this is a little heavy, but it has a good ending. So bear with me for those people. Cause I mean, if you're out there and I just want to say thank you again for having me. And I'm really grateful. This is like a pinch me fearless moment. And Are you also for one second. We're the ones that should be thanking you. I'm so glad to have you. And let me remind everybody because she's going to about to get into some good stuff. I don't want to interrupt her. If you comment below on this video, hashtag SD joy tag two friends. We're going to do a drawing at the end of the day for $250 shopping spree, kind of like what she's talking about. So, okay. So back to, so you're, okay. so what happened? Okay. So um, for those of you, and also I just want to say hi to all my friends and family watching and a, mwah, mwah, to you all, because there's a bunch of people watching who are just sharing in this story of mine that I'm about to tell those of you who don't know me and um and they're cheering me on every step of the way and I'm just so so grateful for all of you guys so hearts and thumbs up and loves to you all um but for those of you who don't know um me and my story I like I said it's a little heavy but my older daughter was actually being bullied at school and I was trying to help her and she, um, you know, trying to teach her to be fearless and help herself and to take the power back. And what ended up happening was she challenged me to do something fearless. And this was the thing that I was terrified to do. <laughs> I mean, math degree and, you know, big job and in project management and corporate and everything else. This was not only like, I was like, no way. And I'm terrified and I think I'm going to fail, but this is the scariest thing that I, that I can do right now, but I'm willing to do it to help show you I can be fearless too. And then, you know, we're going to work through this together. And so that's what I did. I decided to sign up even though my plan was to host. And, uh, we, and also I should mention, I only was going to do this one time. That was my plan. You Once were like, listen, done. I'm, I'm making her a deal that I will sign up and do one, but like, that's it. That's I it. fulfilled my obligation. Right. Because I, I knew, I knew that, you know, I could make my money back in the first event and I could get all the free stuff that I wanted anyway. So I was like right. one and done. That's what, that's where I'm at. And I'm just going to show her I'm fearless and then check that box. And if I fail, okay, then she knows I'm okay with failure. <laughs> Okay, so now what happened? Because obviously that was five years ago and you're still here. Right. So what happened with you? What happened with her? Is what I really so, I, I, so I involved my kids right from the start in my business and they were there at my, my, my launch event. And I had an amazing turnout and we shared the story um, as best as I could because, I mean, it was a little hard for me right then. Things were very um, tender when I talked about it. And a couple of the moms that were there attending wanted to help. I mean, this kid was targeting other kids, but my daughter was the main target. And they were like, well, I just, you know, I would like to do one. I want to help you guys. I want to help you help your daughter. So I thought, well, maybe that's the universe sign to me that I should just do one more and keep the conversation going with her. So I'm just going to do one more. And I decided I'm not going to overthink it. I'm going to do this one and one more and that's it. <laughs> and, that was, and that was the plan. But, um, I mean, the story does end well because I kept just doing one more and she, my, my oldest, she ended up getting the courage to not only 
stand up for herself and help herself, but she also was able to start helping some of those other kids. And along the way, I started becoming fearless too, because how can you like not do this business and be fear not be fearless? Like you have to really get out of your comfort zone. But I was ready and I wanted to, and it was helping her, which was my whole reason for doing this. And I thought, well, for back then it was $199. It's only 99 right now. So, I mean, I totally got screwed on that deal. But okay. <laughs> Yeah, but you've gotten five years out of it, so it's okay. Yeah, I okay, totally have. Yeah. Hit the heart for Alex, because I just love this story. I mean, it's a, great, it's a great parenting story. It's a great female story. It's a great entrepreneurial story. It's like all those things. I love also that, by the way, you're a math genius. <laughs> being a stylist is terrifying because well i'll stylist all day long but don't ask me to do much math so, you know i think it's all the math the math comes in handy in life but but i just wanted to share one last thing about the story and um i i wanted to share that last little bit that um after you know kept doing just one more for about two and a half years i i did build a team i wasn't planning on it but um you know this business is 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 really you get a on the side which is like not by any means a side but you get a tribe of women who are lifting you up in a way that you could never imagine and at that time i really needed some lifting up because i was really like struggling inside it was a tough situation and all those two and a half years in i i, I was having a blast and i was bringing some other people along and we were all having a great time together doing this and then one day I decided to do the ultimate fearless move and quit the big day job on the second day. I, I planned to quit on a certain day and I chickened out and the second day I did it, but I did it. Okay. And so three years ago, um, I, I quit that corporate job and never going back. So your life has changed. By the way, I, I'm trying not to look too much at the comments because I'm listening to what you're saying, but I just want to call out that your husband just said, <laughs> You go, girl, from the family room. Oh, yeah. He's a rock star, by the way. Apparently, Literally. He's like outside in the other room cheering you on. So He totally so. is. And he is probably one of my biggest fans. He's a, he's a rock star, like literally and figuratively. He plays the bass. Oh, so, amazing. oh, yeah. It's is fun he here, having, Red. Is he we need on Glam Getaway? Oh, he totally is. And, and while we have a drummer, we'd be happy to welcome a guest drummer oh, anytime. We can, we can work that out. Just we saying. Can do that. Yeah, I got gotcha. you. We'll see you in Hawaii. We'll see if we can find a band. A band of. Oh, it's on. It's we on. Find I... a house kit somewhere that we can pull out and go. Yeah. To... Right, I can't wait to meet it. But, so Greg, hi. Um, that is name Greg. Yes. Also, You're... my husband's name. Coincidence? I'm not so sure. We're meant to be. All right. Okay. So a lot has changed over the last five years. You left the job. The kids have grown up. Got over that very inspiring story. I love the way you made that into such a positive anything else that has changed in your life over the last five years well I mean the fact that I can make my own hours and I really can have the flexibility to be a hundred percent honest I've been looking for real flexibility in the corporate world and I negotiated things here and there but I will tell you it never was exactly what I needed it wasn't until I stumbled on something right under my nose that I was terrified to do that actually was the real answer to what I was looking for. I mean, I can't believe you guys pay us to do this. I feel like someone's going to knock on my door and be like, um, we need that money back and we need all that free stuff. But um, nobody's done that. And um, I really can contribute to our family um, significantly. And I have fun and I get to include my children and I don't have to miss any of like their field trips or their dance performances or any of that. In fact, we've been able to do a little bit more. My oldest who had, you know, was struggling to be fearless has been in the school play the last three years and got wow. a singing speaking part. I mean, like it has changed our family's life a thousand percent for the better in every way. And while, I mean, this stuff is gorgeous. I mean, it's beautiful clothing, accessories, jewels, but it is so much more than that. And it means the world to my family. I mean, none of this would have been possible. And I never in a million years would have tried this 
if it wasn't for that adversity. It, and it, I would have been missing out. I really. Love I love what an example you set for her too, like school play. Wow. I mean, and you're coming into those teenage years now where like you're going to want that flexibility even more, you know? hundred percent. There's that phase when your kids are little where you're just like, I've been home all day. Or I've been with you people for days. Like, yes, I want to go up and do a style session today. Then there's like the teenage years where you value this job because you can be flexible when they need you. You know, because they, yeah. don't, they don't need you as much, but they need you differently. So, yes, they do. I they absolutely do. What have you done? At Stella Belt, we talk about our little blue card earnings. And just to explain to everybody what that is, when you get paid weekly, uh, your commissions are loaded onto this li literally blue card that looks like a little credit card. And you can either transfer that into your bank account or use it like, like a debit card or like a credit card. So when we say, what's your little blue card done for you? That's what we mean. So Alex, what's your little blue card done for the Stombach family? So a lot. Um... Not only is it helping me, you know, contribute to the family income. I mean, I had a, I had a, a job I left and I had um, a lot of, I, you know, it was a good salary. <laughs> so, um, you know, I'm contributing to the family bills, but um, we've been able to do some really fun stuff too. Um, taking the kids on some like Disney cruises and Turks and Caicos beaches vacations. But I mean, I did mention I have a girl boss office now. That's probably been my most recent purchase. But above all that, um, it's, it's really allowed our family to also give back. I mean, so this experience has been so amazing and so unexpected and so much better than I could have ever imagined. I really love to use my business to give back as well. And I love to do that, you know, as much as possible and involve my children. It really allows us to, to do, do that as a family in a way that we couldn't have otherwise. I mean, for example, this month, um, we are one of the fundraisers that I'm going to be doing all month long up through early May is um, a fundraiser for some uh, an organization called the Laurel House. And they actually um, support families who have um, been victims of domestic violence. And my husband's um, also doing a, a piece as part of this fundraising effort. And so it's a family affair. And um, this, like, it, it, it feels really good to give back in a way that I couldn't have otherwise and really lift some people up and help them in, in a way that we couldn't. And my kids are involved. So they're exposed to, to being able to give back as well as um, they, they are learning an entrepreneurial spirit on the side too. And they're seeing it all kind of come together. And none of this would be possible if it wasn't for this business. Um, so to I me, that. I mean, the earnings, the earnings, I mean, you can choose to, to use your earnings any way you want. I feel like the universe did like the biggest favor to me and, and like literally, you know, kind of forced this to happen, like make, made me choose this. And then, um, I, you know, I, as a form of gratitude, I, I really try to give back as much as possible and, and, and in, involve them, my whole family, but my kids especially, because that has to be learned early, I think. So hey, raising, raising strong girls, it's our job, right? I mean, this business lifted me up and they lift me up and, and it all has just, um, it, 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 it all just really has come together in a way where, um, it's just nothing but joy. And I, I'm, I'm so grateful. So Alex, thank you, you guys. I want to ask you a couple of just quick questions. And by, by the way, if you're watching this, don't forget to tag SD Joy, tag two friends. You can enter it in a drawing. I know you were in math, so it's probably <coughs> obvious, but I'm going to ask you this. Had you ever done anything like this before? No, um, not in a million years, which is one of the reasons why I was so terrified to do it. I never sold anything. Um, and I never did any social selling of any kind. And I, I really wasn't interested in doing anything like that. Um, I, honestly, it wasn't until I got the challenge from my daughter that really changed everything for me and made me see, want to try for her. And then once I tried, um, to be honest, it was everything the opposite of what I thought it was going to be. It was 
so much better than I could have ever expected. And I really would, would have been missing out otherwise. And I was missing out. I just didn't know it. Yeah. <laughs> Do you know what I love about that? Um, a stylist actually texted me this morning. I put it on my Insta story. Tell, and she said exactly that. It, it was like heart, so heartwarming. She was like, I guess I was missing. I was missing out on something I didn't even know I was missing out on yeah. until it was right in front of me. And I, mean, I love that. And I would imagine being in the math field and pharmaceuticals too, you know, fairly sort of logical, you know, right brain kind of industry. It was probably fun to be a little bit more creative and feminine and, you know, all that kind of fun. And, and what's so ironic is um, not only was I terrified to do this and never in a million years would have tried it otherwise, but it was exactly what I was looking for all along. It was right under my nose. And it was, it, I feel like sometimes, you know, the thing you're most afraid of maybe is what you're meant to do. I don't oh, know. Um, mic drop there. Okay. I have one <laughs> last question for you. I also want to next to say hi to Rose um, Cresswell, who, my friend who I just saw scroll by and tag somebody there. So, hey, Rose. Hi, Gina. Um, okay. How... Most of our stylists work full time, 80, over 80%. Most have never done anything like this before, just like Alex. Um, and then most look back and say, wow, what did I wait for? But there's always that kind of moment where you're like, I don't know if I can do this. Maybe now's not the right time, even though all this great new stuff just launched. That stuff, that stuff, all that stuff. You might be, they might be, someone might be thinking that. What would your advice be to somebody <clears throat> who's wondering if it's for them? So uh, my biggest advice is to stop overthinking and just jump on board. You, you will literally be thanking yourself later for doing it. And honestly, I would highly recommend you being open to it being way better than you expected. Like I said before, I, I had a million, million ideas of what this was going to be like in my head. And it was nothing like that. And it's been, it's been so joyful and so amazing. And it's added energy and, and, and goodness and, and just, just so much, you know, so much joy to my family and my life that I never, I just, I never could have expected that. So just join. And what are you waiting for? You guys, you're like, in you... your head, you weren't going to be here five years later, making great money, earning free trips to Hawaii with your husband. That wasn't happening. No, no, <laughs> not <laughs> only that, but like, I, like if you had asked me five years ago, if I would, this is what I was going to be doing. I bet my house that you, that I, that's not, that wouldn't have been true. Like I literally in a million years would have said, hell's no. <laughs> No way. That's a serious bet. So I'm glad it yeah. worked out. All right, I'm glad it Alex Gamuck, you are delightful. I always love it whenever I'm in the Northeast and get to meet you and hang out with you. And I really am looking forward to spending time with you and your Greg, with me and my Greg in Hawaii in a few weeks. Aloha. I'm like ready. My legs are so white. You'll know where I am. It'll be like a beacon <laughs> from the other side of the resort. So I got I to gotta do something about that. So... I just want to thank off and for anybody who's thinking about joining us, I mean, I think I can't say it any better than Alex has. We do have a great special going on this month. It's in our final month uh, where you can sign up in two ways. They're both super easy. My favorite way is pick a, or do the easy button. And for $199, you get a thousand dollars in pre-selected product, our best sellers. So it's literally like press the button and go. Or you can opt into our other option, which for $99, you get to choose $500 um, of your choice. And that's fun, too. Either way, you get off to a great start. We've got support for you. Just like Alex, nobody's ever done this before. So we'll help you. We make it super fun and easy. It's like part of my job is to make sure it's super fun and easy for you. Um, so that you can, like, you know, get a few of these things. Okay, should we show a couple other things on our way out of here? Yeah. By the way, so these are our new ColourPop floral earrings. And they come, this is like transformers for girls, okay? They come with all these things. So you can like build these into your own earring. Or of course you can wear just the hoop. Or you can wear just one. I don't even know how many of these there are. They keep coming because they're reversible. There's like two different colors in each. 
for well, those of you for those of you who have like teenagers um or need gifts like for the easter easter gifts oh. this this what danielle is showing you is top of my 13 year old daughter's list number one so much so that she is willing to work for those babies oh so, wow if a 13 year old will work for something these are powerful earrings they are and she could rock them yeah, I and love uh, I love also these. i mean those are amazing and they're amazing yeah. for all ages but if you guys need a gift i'm just saying like they're perfect love. how about this one how about this one danielle these this petal collection i love actually those are that i'm wearing the gold earring version of those i love this delicate petal collection it's so i'm it's obsessed with this face. i'm sorry i'm yeah, obsessed beautiful. and it comes obsessed. in gold too for my gold girls okay i love look at me i'm just knocking everything off of my wall this is the one that i'm probably the most obsessed with um and it looks great over this is our double v sweater that i'm wearing which actually looks great with this so you can do it like over a sweater, but really cute over our white tank and summer cardigan. Super cute with like that lemon clutch. Okay, one more thing is so over here. I gotta grab it before we go. Because I can't. I'm obsessed with this too. How about this macrame clutch? Can you see that? I'm, you know what? I didn't sample that yet, but then after we went to our team meeting and got to see it live, I was like, oh, I think I have to have that. I mean, um, yes. And you can do a cross body strap on it too. So like, I'm bringing this to Hawaii. Sure. I mean, job perk, right? Like we get all this free stuff raining on our doorstep all the time. <laughs> like I said, notes and pens. we get can't believe of these things. I can't believe they pay us to do this. I'm so grateful, seriously. And this is why I give back because I really, really am grateful. Alex Stanbach could not love you more. We'll just keep holding product out as we product our way out here. Thank you for joining us. Thank you to Greg Steinbach for holding down the fort in the family room, apparently. He and is. to everybody who watched, don't forget, comment, hashtag SDJoy, tag a couple of friends. We're going to do a drawing for $250 in product. You get to pick. I don't know what you're going to pick because there are a lot of amazing choices like this guy, too, which I happen to have sitting here which can go be reversible. So um, I don't know how you're going to pick, but I hope you'll also pick to maybe be a stylist with us because we would love to have you join us as we go into this incredible summer season. You can take that scarf and your samples. Um, so Alex, keep showing some fun stuff as I log us out here. But thank you guys for joining. Go to Stella.com and you can sign up. Or you might choose this. Oh, when, life gives you, when life gives you lemons, you wear them. Just wear some studs. <laughs> Mic drop, Alex Stambach.